When you launch Anthem for the first time, you're presented with this screen where you change some options, your language and your subtitles and so on. And then once you're done, you're finally ready to... Ah, uh, you... Egg... Hold on. Is it... Oh, is it... No, it's this button because... Duh. I like playing Anthem a lot. I really do. But the game makes itself difficult for no reason at all. And I mean difficult in the sense that it's hard to understand, it doesn't explain really important things, and the interface is just a mess at times. Like, what the fuck is this? That screen at the beginning, the first thing you see in the whole game, sums it up perfectly. Why is it this here? Why is it this here? Have you ever used a menu before? And it's not just that. I've got a big fucking list of things to whine about here, so let's get going. But before we do that, I just want to clarify, I really do like this game. I like the movement, and I like the shooting, just... God. Who thought the radar was a good idea? This thing that looks like it came off a toy, it's just so unusable. Anytime I have to do one of these find the item objectives, it's way easier just to look for it on the ground. Unless it's one of these things, like, come on! It's too slow to update, it's not granular enough, the height indicator isn't big enough. How many other games have done 3D maps and mini maps before? How did... Why isn't there a text chat? Why can't I see all my stats in the forward? Why is detonating strike called detonating strike when it isn't a detonator? What? Come to think of it, what's a detonator? What's a primer? What the fuck is a combo? I don't know, because the tutorial levels don't mention them at all. You have to figure them out through trial and error, which I guess is kind of fun, but still. Oh, no, you can press G and you can look at the codex and you can... If a part of your game is really important, teach it through gameplay. Don't put it in a leaflet that nobody's gonna read. Speaking of which, why the fuck's the quest log in the codex? Put it in the pause menu. This shit's important. Don't put it in a filing cabinet in the back of a fucking tax office. Why can't I sort components by type or by class? Why is every paint colour button like this? It's quicker to salvage items one by one than it is to put them into the junk tab and salvage them all together. Seriously, look at this. Yep. Hmm. If only there was a better way of doing it. Stop reminding me to open, open the codex the for the Legionnaire challenges. One, I've already done them, and two, the fact that you put a tooltip there means that you know it's hard to find. There's a button to track a challenge or a quest, but all it does is put its name in the top right corner, or it doesn't put anything at all. Just, just fuck it. Side note, why do I have to open 15 treasure chests, harvest 25 minerals, repair 3 javelins, and collect 10 fucking bucks just to progress the story? Just seems weird, you know? Just, just Insane. By the way, the reason I just don't turn those tooltips off is because they're the number one way to tell if your teammates are down. The icons and visual feedback on your HUD are just pathetic. Most of the time I just get lucky and happen to look in their direction. So this tooltip's actually better at conveying that information than anything else. It doesn't pop up half the time, but it's still better. When a teammate goes down, that's important information you would like to know right away. This is just not good enough. Oh, I died! Hurry up and save me, you fa- How do I quit free play? I'll just press escape and then... Pre Hold on. Oh, press F. Because... No. No? No. But these are just minor design problems, right? The rest of the game's absolutely perfect. No. I'm not even going to mention the technical issues and the bugs and other things. I'm just going to assume these get fixed by patches in the future. But I think the design decisions I've been moaning about just shouldn't have been in the game in the first place. I think it's very obvious that I'm not a designer, I'm not a UX expert, I just know when something's obviously wrong. I hope I'll look back at this video in about six months and see these problems at least acknowledged, if not addressed. Seriously though, detonating strike, what the fuck? Anyway, so far I've been pretty negative. So now I'm gonna list the things I really like about the game. <clears throat> Number uh, 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 first, first person entry! 